What's up, Twitter nerds? Welcome back to another Twitter Nerd Tennis video here today on the channel. Today we have a very special interview with 17-year-old Ashton Kruger, a two-time Orange Bowl champion, had a wild card at this year's US Open, and we had the chance to interview her at the Midland Dow Tennis Classic. And I'm very appreciative of doing this one with her. She is definitely a star to look out for. We were able to interview her and Katrina Scott at this tournament, so I'm very appreciative of Jacob giving me the opportunity to interview them. Please make sure to leave a like on this video's mode. Make sure you subscribe to Twitter Tennis so that way you don't miss more interviews like these. Can't wait to show you guys this one. Enjoy the video. Ashlyn, thank you so much for joining me today. Yeah, I really appreciate it. Mm -hmm. um, first of all, I want to say congratulations for playing in this tournament, even though it wasn't the result you expected. But mm -hmm. how would you sum up the performance you gave in the first round? Um, I think a lot of learning went into play mm -hmm. yesterday. Um, my fight came out for sure never going to give up on a match. So mm -hmm. I think kind of learning how to bring that out in the starting games um, is really important for me. Um, but overall, I, I did a lot of good things, just strategy from here on out. And for you being 17, correct? I'm just mm -hmm. going to just to clarify that um, you are very mature on the court. You've won two Orange Bowls. You've been a U.S. Open junior champion. What's it like to have this much success i would say at such a young age does that kind of put everything in everything into perspective um that's a good question i <laughs> think it's uh i think it's more cool for me I don't <laughs> a lot of pressure you know i think Love it's, that. Just, it's very very cool to do it and be able to say like i won two orange bowls or mm -hmm. US Open champion um and it gives me confidence you know and, and that's really what i need going into these tournaments with all these seasoned players is just confidence in myself and my game and how would you describe yourself off the court? <laughs> you can um, you can say it. It's okay. <laughs> um, I don't know. I'm, I mean, I'm kind of like quiet, I guess. Very laid back. I don't do a lot. I just kind of read and draw, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> no, that's um, okay. And but yeah, my life is kind of around tennis, so I don't have a lot of free time. But <laughs> is that, do you think that's... Um, I would say not like a bad thing, but do you mm -hmm. think that it's hard to kind of balance yourself as being a 17 year old mm -hmm. and playing against people that have been on tour for seven, eight years? Is yeah. that, is that hard? It's definitely new okay. and it's frustrating and hard, but I like it and um, it's what I want to do. So you kind of have to deal with it, you know, <laughs> but um, yeah, it's, it's frustrating. It, it, in what way do you find it frustrating because of the amount of time that you dedicate on the court, which is not a bad thing because mm -hmm. you're having so much success in tennis, mm -hmm. but the sacrifices that you're making, what's been the biggest sacrifice that you've faced so far? Um, the biggest sacrifice would probably be just being home with my family. That's the most frustrating part is just being separated from my dad or my sister or my mom or my sister. I'm lucky because I'm a minor. I get to travel with a parent, mm -hmm. but um, just kind of that family life aspect is, it's not always there. Mm. And do you find that with working in Florida or working in Texas, do you find that being surrounded by people is better than traveling alone? I think being surrounded by people that I enjoy and, and trust is much better than being alone for sure. For you, if for those of people that don't know about your style and your game, how would you describe your game to those who are just watching this or listening to this for the first time? Mm -hmm. um, I think I'm a very aggressive player and mm -hmm. I like to come forward, um, look for anything short and just attack, you know, take time away. Um, mm -hmm. What do you, what's the best thing you like to draw or what's, what's your favorite thing to kind of, that helps you kind of relax and focus on? Honestly, I would say reading more than drawing. Really? Yeah. What do you like to read? Anything, any, <laughs> literally anything. <laughs> literally anything. What are you reading right now? Um, I'm reading a novel. It's called all the light we cannot see. I recommend okay. it. It's very good. I love that. My friend keeps a, whole excel sheet of what book she wants to read and what is good I to do read. That too. So, yeah. do you really yeah how many books have you read um a lot too many <laughs> too many I mean, too many for the spreadsheet 
Yeah. <laughs> well, Ashley, I really appreciate you taking time out of your yeah, day. And so I can't wait to see you on court next. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah.